What's up guys? Today's a big day. I got my cabinets I ordered. I had measured and ordered for my bus and uh, we're gonna reinforce them and get them in, hopefully today. He's working on it now, but he's got a cookout to go to, so we might not get it done today, but up with my saw, I got my safety goggles on. You know, he's all about safety, the union carpenters there. <laughs> but no, I've cut these pieces for him to mount them, to help mount, do whatever I can. I got them right there. Boom! Look at that. All oh, precision cut. <laughs> I, I, I'm joking. And I'm always messing things up compared to what he does. But, uh, yes. The uh, backs of these painted black uh, because when they go up against the windows that I had tinted extra darker, um, when the sun hits, you can still see about doorknobs, magnets, keep them shut. I'm, I'm also going to have to reinforce them. These are just cheap half-inch uh, particle board, really. Um, but doing what we're doing, I got liquid nail. We're gluing them all together. We're bolting them all together. We're bolting them to the bus. It's going to be strong. It's not going to fall off. Um, I'm going to make something good out of something cheap is what I'm trying to do. Uh, I think it'll turn out all right. I got two on the side that are longer than the two in the middle. Now, it's not going to be like in most kitchens because... I wanted as much storage as I could, so there, there's only like a six or ten inch, somewhere between six and ten inches difference. But they'll, you'll see, they'll look alright. Uh, the generator, I'm not that far, I'm ready for that. But that's where I'm at right now, the cabinets. I do got my shocks, I got a video I'm going to post about that on YouTube eventually. I just haven't gotten to it. But TJ and Dylan, Paul and Mike, Taj all helped me do my shocks a couple weeks ago. I, I got a, a problem with leaf springs, I think, in the back because it still rides hard. Um, I know it's a one-ton, a dually. I understand that. But there's no way this thing come from the factory riding as rough as it does. So I'm going to probably get a price and end up doing it, getting bigger springs put on the back, new ones, at least new ones, because uh, I think they're broke. I was looking up underneath there and where one of the brackets are, it looks like they're cracked and slid a little bit. The U-bolts are kind of slid at an angle, which I don't think they're supposed to be. So I think I got something going on there. When you lift the lift up with me on it, this whole side drops. And it's all suspension because these body mounts right there, see them? Those don't flex at all. So, that is definitely all suspension. And the being right there at the leaf springs, that should not drop as bad as it does. Even though this thing's empty, not me on, without me on it, it still drops a lot. So, there's something going on there. I'm going to get that figured out. So, I'm not driving 2,000 miles with it banging on every pothole or bump like it does. But, um, yes, yeah, so happy holiday weekend. I hope everybody is. Uh, this is what I'm having fun doing. This is my fun and I'm glad I got Chuck here doing it. So hopefully, be right, Chuck? Okay. We're gonna get this done today, right? Uh, mainly, yeah, tomorrow. <laughs> <in the morning. laughs> There's a little bit of work. Yeah, we'll get it. All right. But I hope everybody's having a good holiday weekend. Uh, do what your wife says. Smack her around a little bit if she don't. No, I'm kidding. I don't believe in that at all. But I hope everybody's having a good weekend. Um, I am. I've been waiting for these cabinets for a while, so finally gonna get some something done on the inside. I haven't been on the inside for a couple months, so I'm excited. So that's all I've got to say out there. <laughs>